So, let's talk about boxing. But first, Boxing is something that I've been photographing for about three years now. And it's uh, it's something I never would have thought of doing when I started my photography journey. But my, my mom suggested going to do the local gym. And it's been a huge part of building me up as the creative I am now. Uh, working within the boxing gym walls allowed me to use my camera get the different shots of all the boxes telling their story allowing me to use my settings in lonely areas all that sort of stuff oh man this high fever is killing me oh, allergy season is not the one anyway and through taking photos within the gym you start to build friendships and bonds with the boxers uh it really helps solidify that story of who the boxers are at heart and through these friendships, I met one of my close friends now, Dale Flute. He actually trains in another gym that I took photos for. And it wasn't till after I realised he coached at the gym I took photos for. And we kind of just went from there. Well, anyway, tonight is his second pro fight. And I'm there to photograph and video the event. And... It's, I've seen how he trains, it's otherworldly, the conditions they put themselves in, how they train, the eating regimen, it's just something I can't do man, I like food too much, but it's truly inspiring to just see the boxers for who they are at heart, the fighters, but the things they put themselves through is amazing it's nothing i would want but when you see them out there in the ring you best be ready because they are bringing a storm so the main goal of this video really is to just kind of photograph the fight and document what's going on come back with some cool photos and video I'm gonna try and speak to him but to be fair he will probably be absolutely shattered so i'll we'll get something with him but it might not be till another time so, observing boxing for the past three years through my lens and my camera, I've always noticed one thing. When the boxers step into the ring, it's almost like a switch is flicked. They switch off to all the outside entities, the people scream, the family members, all these different things going on outside the ring. They don't matter anymore because the only things that matter is the opponent and the coach. And, you know... You can't get distracted in these fights because you'll lose and nobody wants to lose. So, yeah, so that's all from me. Let's hit the road, get some cool photos, get some cool videos and I'll report back to you when it's all over and done. So I'll go as soon as he punches me, I know it
51. It's been so long. I was meant to make this part of the vlog over a month ago, but with everything what happened after the fight, like it happened so fast. He just like he won, he went out drinking, and then after that time just kind of went on and just kind of forgot to make the second part of the vlog. But here's some photos to show how he did. And apart from that, it's just going to be a short one because there's new stuff coming, what I want to start getting out there. So, yeah, don't forget to like, subscribe, follow the Instagram, hit that like button, tell what you thought, and I will see you all in the next one.